What's going on, everybody? Pop Principal here with another Funko Pop review. Um, today we have Absolute Carnage, the deluxe version, as they're calling it. There's a few different um, a uh, Absolute Carnage uh, pops that are out there. They have a glow. Um, uh, I don't know if you call them Grendel or uh, just Carnage Pops, but with that Grendel, I know the logo, the Grendel logo on the forehead. Um, there's maybe one or two different ones that they might have. I know there's a Glow and there's a Common. I'm going to eventually get those when I get around to it. Um, but a Deluxe Pop, very dope. It, it is actually directly from a comic book cover. Um, you guys should look it up and... and do the research on this particular uh funko if you have any interest um very dope storyline now i actually got this pop i didn't i was going to order i forget where i was going to order it from but i end up stumbling across it in video game world which their funkos 90 percent of them are overpriced you can find better uh prices on ebay macari um hell even they some of them you can still find retail prices for some of the things that they have uh uh pretty high for example um they have oh my god they have like eternal pops for like 30 40 dollars i'm like how is that possible how do you have eternal pops like the common uh um cersei uh and the uh clothed um Icarus they had those for like thirty dollars in in the case I'm like dude what what are you guys doing and then they have like a that glow in the dark iron heart for fifty dollars which is pretty standard it's actually cheaper than you can find it most places but um that's neither here nor there um I if you guys ever walk and stumble across or find yourself in a video game world I would say look online before actually making a purchase uh to see what the difference in price is if it's only a couple dollars I, I i understand but if it's a drastic difference you can find it much cheaper so that's just a little game for you guys i actually had some store credit with them so i because i had once i kind of got hip to the game i uh sold them a lot of my pops and i uh sold enough to, that i actually could get this one so i was super excited to get it and i'm glad i have it so let's get right into an outer box look of this absolute carnage pop and here we have a look at the absolute carnage pop uh with the grendel symbol on his head this is in a glow which i feel like it should be but you see all the little details in the skulls and the cemetery our tombstones that um he's standing on top of you see the symbiote uh um coming out of him and, and i guess help balancing him on the actual tombs just touching all of them um very cool storyline i'm not uh i'm not super thorough with the storyline but i do know um what's his cletus cassidy uh was trying to start a cult and, and basically destroy everybody who uh ever had a or ever donned the symbiote suit. Um, he was basically going to turn him into uh, his cult and start destruction. So um, not, I forget how that story actually played out. Um, this was, I, I've listened to the Venom um, storyline quite a few times on Comic Explained. He does a really, really good job, if you guys want to know. Uh, I didn't take a liking to the Carnage storyline as much. Not saying it wasn't good. It was just the Venom storyline was so good. And it's still going on. So if you guys have any interest, definitely check out Comments Explain. Um, but you see all the little different details of the symbiote going down uh, his arm and um, down all the way to the skulls. It's, it's very detailed. I, I really enjoy this pop. They did a really good job with this. You see the different colors, that dark gray and I mean, not dark gray, dark red uh, and regular red, like a crimson red. They got it all mixed in there. It looks really dope. It gives it a lot of detail, makes it pop. So um, if you guys uh, have any interest in this pop, um, I believe you can find it for a fair price. Uh, I, I think video, I think I might have had like $35 credit and got this particular pop, but um, which is closer to retail because I believe it was a $30 pop originally uh, or somewhere in that ballpark. So um, 
go look for it. I don't think it's in at any retailers at the moment. Maybe uh, uh, Entertainment Earth, maybe. Um, but if not, you should be able to find it for a de- decent price um, on M- at Macari or uh, eBay. Uh, so like, subscribe, tune in. And here we have another comparison shot of the uh, Absolute Carnage Deluxe version and that uh, Venom Deluxe version with the um, diorama, quote unquote, stands uh, with these two particular pops, which I think look really good. They did a really good job um, detailing these pops and and giving us something different uh, other than the um standard traditional three inch pops or six inch pops they gave us a little more with these and i really enjoy these pops um as you can see um now i believe both of these come directly from comic book covers so you can find these uh basically a facsimile uh of these two pops on a comic cover i know for sure absolute carnage and i'm pretty sure you can with venom i just didn't look it up prior to doing a video so um very dope looking pops. Uh, I, in my humble opinion, I would have to go with uh, if these two were to battle at their height, I would definitely have to go with Venom, um, the symbiote uh, king. So uh, let me know what you guys think about this video or uh, or these not this video, but these pops, um, the video as well. You can chime in. Uh, let me know if you guys pick these up. If you have any interest, do you want more? Uh, Carnage pops with the Grendel symbol. Um, do you want more Venom pops? Which they haven't really stopped with the Venom pops. Like I said, they have uh, a mystery box uh, currently uh, on Funko's website, which I is sold out and it's um, has uh, a release uh, notify me um, area where the mystery box is. Now it did actually. Um, released yesterday or a couple days ago but it sold out almost instantly of course so uh let me know what you guys think like subscribe tune in uh leave a comment and i'll keep them coming pop principal out